Good morning and thanks for joining us. Today we share some tips on how to make your money go farther and learn the inspiration behind one man's mission of seven marathons on seven continents. But first, we get an exclusive look at the newest upscale spa in Dallas. Here's reporter Danielle Doty with more. I am here at the newly opened Delash Studio and Spa, where they are redefining the Lash experience. I sat down with owner Kasha Barron to find out more. The Lash is here in Dallas to redefine the Lash experience. I started in the beauty industry when I was just 13 years old and I fell in love with how much it can change people's appearance and how awesome can make anybody feel. So right behind all these awesome doors, we're going to have all the products that we carry here at Delash. The first thing that I want to introduce you to is our Eminence Organic Skincare line. All these products are handmade in Hungary, so everything is uh, shipped to us super fresh, never older than two weeks. It's all about being clean, being polite, being friendly, and doing the best possible service you can using the best products out there on the market. We brush our hair every day, wash them, clean them, condition them, but we don't brush our lashes. A lot of women will take care of their hair, take care of their skin, but they kind of forget to take care of their lashes. I am so excited. I'm getting a sneak peek to all of the Eminence add-on treatments. Let's check it out. One of the most popular products will be your bamboo firming fluid. It. It, think of a serum, but in more of a creamy consistency. What it's gonna do to you, it's gonna uh, help speed up production of collagen by 25% just in six days. So we do eyelash extensions, we do eyebrow extensions as well. We do lash perming, it's also known as lash lifting for nat your natural lashes. Tinting, we also do Eminence Organic Facials. All products are handmade, everything smells really good. It's a natural alternative to a lot of chemicals that people attempt to use in their skincare line. How do you know if you get a good facial? Leave with bad hair. Those are exact same products that I use for eyelash extensions or for people that want to take them home and clean their lashes on a daily usage or to remove the makeup. We also want to encourage everybody to get facials prior to the lash application. This is going to be the time where you can actually relax for 30 minutes, 60 minutes, 90 minutes. You lay down with your eyes closed, they're fully closed through the whole procedure. You're in a comfortable bed with a comfortable blanket kids on top of you and you just enjoy the comforting music, you take a little nap. We also offer two different type of waxing services and we also do Norvell Sunless Tanning which is customized, done by hand to every skin tone out there and we can customize anything to you and it's also well known because of Dancing with the Stars. That was the best feeling facial I've ever had. My skin feels great, my lips feel even better. I know I'll be coming back for a full facial, you better too. If you'd like to learn more about Dow Lash and all the services they provide, go to DowLashStudio.com. From upscale spas to upscale wardrobes, Stanley Korshak has been selling fine men's clothing in Dallas since 1986. Personal stylist Chris Wright explains what makes Stanley Korshak a good fit for those seeking high-end attire. Here at Stanley Korshak, what makes us a unique is a personalized experience, and everyone is different and unique to the person that comes to visit us. It's about relationships with our clients, and that's the baseline for everything that we do. Our customers' clothing is very important to their business and to their lifestyle. So once you engage with an associate here, they're going to find out what it is that you do for a living. How do you need to present yourself? And during the week and during the day may be completely different than in your lifestyle. So that's very important. Also, your body type is very important. There's certain brands that fit better for, for some and not for others. So it's about finding that consistency. So each man out there has a personal style. And what we do is when we work with our customers is we want to find out what that style is. The men that shop with us, they're real men in real businesses and they need real clothing. When you put a garment on, it ends up shaping to your body over time and it becomes like a second skin. And all of a sudden, instead of wanting to take a coat off when you go to work, you want to leave it on because you feel better because it's, it's so comfortable on. I've always felt that the Italian people are very passionate, whether they're making a coffee or a car or, a, or clothing, for instance, or pasta. That passion goes into everything that they make, and we're, we're the beneficiaries of that. All the brands that are in the main store are, are made with that kind of quality. Bontoni is a brand that we selected about 10 years ago, and the most beautifully made shoes one would ever want to have or see. 
Uh, Andre Artioli, third generation family, a little shop out of Milan. I was recently in the factory. The passion that goes into this product, the handwork that goes into this product. We also have Di Bianco, uh, Keton. They're, they're known as one of the finest made garments in the world. And when you go to the factory, there are no machines over there. It's done by hand. It's just remarkable. So we're very fortunate there's some of these wonderful brands that we're able to bring in and share with our customers. We also have one of the finest master tailors in America and men come to him for that very reason, because he is so good. Many men that come to us that already shop this, they already have a certain level of style. We just elevate it to a new level and, and, bring, and introduce some new product and new looks and new ideas. To see more of Stanley Korshak's huge selection of clothes and accessories, visit their website at stanleykorshak.com. Time for our first break, but don't go anywhere. We learn all about youth sports with the one and only Jim Knox in Knox's Playbook. We'll be right back. Today with Candace is brought to you by Weir's Furniture. Weir's Furniture is family owned and has been helping DFW families create their own special style of living for nearly 70 years. With a visit to Weir's, you can pick from hundreds of items for indoor and outdoor living. And you don't have to drive far. They have five locations in the Metroplex. Kids eat too much sugar. We know that. And they shouldn't. We know that. It causes weight gain, it can cause tooth problems. Uh, I don't think there's much to that hyperactivity part with sugar, but you know, if your kid eats too much sugar and they get hyper, eat less sugar, of course. Now, how much is too much sugar? Well, we get a certain amount of sugar through our diet, and uh, the studies say and the recommendations are that if a male gets more than 150 calories of sugar above and beyond the normal diet, and that would be nine teaspoons, for example, then that's too much. In a female, it's a, a hundred calories which is about six teaspoons. Now to put that in perspective, a uh, 12 ounce uh, can of Coca-Cola, for example, is about 140 calories. So if you're a male, you've about done it with one Coke. Uh, if you're female, you've overdone it. A Snickers bar, oh my gosh, I love those things. A Snickers bar, 120 uh, calories. So if you're a woman, you're over your 100 uh, calories. If you're a man, you've still got 30 left and you can have a, maybe a fifth of a Coke. So, Cut down on the sugar for your kids. In an emergency, your most important need is time. Time saved in the hands of highly trained doctors and experienced emergency nurses. Time saved with advanced imaging and diagnostics to help find a solution quickly. No matter what hour or day, we are here for you. Because when your life is on the line, what matters most is time. Texas General Hospital. We care. Sweetheart, think about your future. Jeff over there did, and just look at him. He saved up, bought a house. He's got a beautiful wife. They even had a fancy pants destination wedding. And oh, oh, they had a baby. Ah! Smart and handsome, ooh la la. Ugh. Now I've been saving these frames for pictures of my future grandbabies for years. And the shopping sprees on organic clothing and eye telephone cases is not helping you save for a family. Oh gracious, look at that, he's a model. <gasps> I bet you he's putting all that money right into a 401k or his baby's college fund. And his teeth are so straight. See how good saving can look at feedthepig.org. Feed the pig. Na, 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 na. I love you so. I love you. I love you. La, 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 la. La, 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 la. We're here. Yay! It's a short drive from your neighborhood to your naturehood. To find a neighborhood park or green space near you, visit discovertheforest.org. In 
and joining me now is our own Jim Knox. He's back for Knox's Playbook. Hey, Jim, how are you? Hey, doing great, Candace. Good. Good to be back. And yes. I guess, you know, you're talking fall sports right we now. Yeah, I can't believe we're already in the fall. Fall, and that means football, right? That's football right. for the kids. And a lot of parents out there are wondering, you know, should I get my kids into football? Kind of dangerous. A lot thinking. of hard hits. Mm -hmm. You know, you have a uh, few girls, so you don't have to worry about that. Just one little man. One little man. And That's let's right. hope he and just he, sticks with baseball. And right. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so but, I don't even have to go down that path. But there are a lot of options, believe it or not, okay. for football. Tell First of all, it. you can play seven on seven football all the way through high school. Oh, and wow. it's seven on seven touch. Okay. And so leagues right now, there's a great league going on in Keller. It's a Texas Elite 7-on-7, seven seven. and what happens is they also have a little foam helmets where you you're, uh, have to wear. So in case you fall down catching a pass, you're well protected on that end. Okay. So that is going on. you got 7-on-7 seven seven and, of course, flag football at a lot of uh, recreation centers is y, YMCA's and that going on. Do you and then know what you, ages those start? From 7-on-7 seven seven touch, you have leagues going as second grade okay. all the way up to high school. Oh, wow, okay. And flag football goes from kindergarten, pre-kindergarten, uh, all the way up to really third or fourth wow. grade. Okay. And then from there, they li would like you to get into the football pads that I know a lot of moms out there are, whoa, pads, yeah. hitting, all that stuff. For but sure. nowadays, they are working on new technology, mm -hmm. and if you really think about it, as you get a little older, fourth, fifth, sixth graders, when you put on pads, the impact is not going to be as hard as if you're playing like in college football sure. or pro football. By that time, maybe when your little guy grows up, the technology will be a lot better. I but have right so. now, if you have a fourth, fifth, sixth grader, the impact, if you're in pads, it, you don't. I don't think you have to worry about any kind of concussion type mm -hmm. syndromes or anything like that because it will happen but not as much as the little guys. It, right. will, it will happen usually later on in life when the impact of players get stronger, bigger and faster. That's when it will happen. Okay. But there are alternatives, okay? Seven on seven football, flag football, those are great to get the kids involved in and that will take care of your fall, right? That's as right. You, you have your games on Saturday, some play Sunday, then you get to watch your favorite teams like for you, Texas A&M play wait. on Saturday, and the Cowboys on Sunday. So you get your little football game out of the way, and then that's it. I love it. Okay, well thanks so much for being with us as always, right, we'll see you. you next week. All right. All right, thanks Jim. Break time again, but when we return, Vicki Griffith gets the blood pumping with a new workout routine, and we heard the incredible story of one young man's journey from the hospital bed to the finish line. Stay with us. This segment of Today with Candace has been brought to you by the Best of Guide. Don't worry, the 74 people were picked before me in the NFL draft. To fight childhood obesity, United Way and the NFL are helping kids play at least 60 minutes a day. Okay, time for the team obstacle course. Yay! What this place needs is more healthy kids. To get involved or donate, go to unitedway.org play 60. Now I get it. Hi, I'm Jim Knox, and a lot of people have asked me, hey, what do you do away from the ballpark? Well, I am co-founder of a company called Identity Media Services. Our Emmy Award winning production team can brand your company with videos, commercials, radio and television and our digital performance program specializes in lead generation, websites and reputation management. So if your business needs a lift, give me a call because as you know, it is tough to stay on top. Whew, that's gotta hurt. Every day across America, excess food is gathered by a network of good people at local food banks, giving hope to millions of children who struggle with hunger. They've earned their wings, and you can too. Together, we can solve child hunger. Support Feeding America and your local food bank at feedingamerica.org.
Welcome back. One of the main goals people have when they start to exercise is to flatten their bellies. Well, Vicki Griffith has an easy exercise for us today to help accomplish that goal. This is the flat belly workout. So let's talk about what you're gonna use. A Pilates ball like we're using, or playground ball. They're pretty inexpensive to find, a kid's ball. Some weight is optional. So we're using dumbbells today. Actually, Susie is showing the modification without weight. So follow her if you're a beginner. And you could also use water bottles or soup cans. Let's start out on the floor. We're gonna use a mat. You can use your carpet at home. And let's talk about placement of the ball. So here, I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna represent all the shorties with the short torso. And I'm gonna put it right behind my sacrum and then follow Susie. She's gonna take the ball a little bit higher up. She's got a longer torso. So if you have a longer torso, that's where you need to go. Or if you have any back issues, start with the ball higher up and follow Susie. Here, I'm gonna use weight. Again, follow Susie if you're not gonna use weight. Pull the belly towards the spine. We're gonna take our hands right behind our knees to get into that neutral spine position. Necks are long. And let's go ahead and start out with our arms up. And we're gonna breathe in for two. That's your tempo. And then blow out really using a nice deep breath, and the key is not going too fast. So breathe in, blow out, breathe in. I want you to do about 15 to 20 of this particular exercise. Here, you can go a little bit longer once you get into it and you've practiced this. You've got the form down, you've got the rhythm down, but make sure you breathe. And keeping those elbows soft, like you're hugging a big ball, Let's do about two more. And then last one, breathe in, blow out. I'm gonna set my weight down and then arms back up, pull that belly towards your spine and we're gonna take the arm out to the side and then back in. And we're really getting that love handle area where that alcohol and fried food goes. And let's do about one more set. Breathing, about 20 total here. Again, you can take the reps up. Again, keeping that neck long, that neutral spine, that slight arch in your back. And last set here. And then you're on your way to your flat belly. Make sure you do that exercise sets three times. As far as repetitions go, I would keep it in the strength endurance phase, about 15 to 20 reps, and you can do more as you progress. Thanks for that great workout, Vicki. For even the most physically fit people, finishing a marathon is a true test of endurance. For cancer survivor Matt Jones, it became not only a goal to reach for, but a reminder of a journey that was much longer than 26.2 miles. 9-11-2002, got a phone call from my doctor, and that's when he said, the test results came back and you're sicker than we thought. Later that day, went to the hospital and they confirmed age of 23, diagnosed with leukemia. Three months, uh, three rounds of chemotherapy, three hospital stays, I was in remission, and, but in January of 2004, started having some really massive headaches, and that's when they discovered that it came back and actually spread to the cerebral spinal fluid in my brain, and that's when I was told less than 10% chance of living. And around Valentine's Day 2004, I slipped to unconscious state. They didn't think I was gonna live, and against all odds, I, I recovered from that. And I remember as I put one arm around the physical therapist, one arm around my dad, and they, they took one leg and they put it in front of the other, one by one. And that day they began the process of helping me to relearn how to walk. And I remember my dad saying, he said, Matt, you can do it, one step at a time, son. In my mind, I had this crazy idea. I thought running a marathon, because I thought to myself, if I could run a marathon, I'd be healthy again. That's like the ultimate endurance event. So my very first marathon happened two years and four months after I took that first step again by myself. And it was just such a, a surreal experience, you know, to think about all I came through. At one point I was, you know, laying in a hospital bed. Now I finished a marathon. It was just one of the greatest just feelings and experiences of my life. So after I finished this first marathon, I was like, I'm done, no more. And I met this couple and they were planning on doing seven marathons on seven continents. So that started me on a whole nother journey. I said, what a cool goal. So this past January, I completed my sixth marathon on my sixth continent in Antarctica. And then three days later, I finished my goal of completing seven marathons on seven continents when I completed my seventh one in Chile. 
And I've been able to take my experience of overcoming my challenges and achieving greater victory to go around and share that message to audiences of all types as an inspirational, motivational speaker. When you're going through hell, you don't stop. Because I realize, you know, we all have these, these challenges. We all have these marathons. And what I share in my talks is by visualizing your victory, by taking action, by elevating your attitude, is that no matter what you're faced with, you can overcome it and you can cross your finish line and achieve your victory. What an amazing story. To learn more about Matt and to schedule him to speak at your event, visit his website at matthewdjones.com. Time for our last break, but when we return, we'll learn about Principle 6 Fertility and how this new supplement is helping couples realize their dream of having a family. Plus, we'll get some tips on how to save money on an evening out in DFW. Stay with us. If your business falls into one of our theme categories of home, health and beauty, or leisure, and you'd like to be promoted on our show, drop us a line at info at todaywithcandice.com. So here at Gonzales Bariatrics, we offer three different types of weight loss surgery, laparoscopic wound my gastric bypass, laparoscopic sleeve gastrectomy, and the laparoscopic adjustable gastric band. We also offer revisional surgery. It's important for me to be the surgeon doing their surgery because I've met with them in the office. They've gotten to know me, I've gotten to know them, and I think it's very, very important not only with the surgery, and that's also gonna be very instrumental in, in their success after surgery. Marie, you have prediabetes. Prediabetes? I don't have time to eat right or exercise. I'm a busy mom. Oh, you're a busy mom. Yeah. This is great news. Busy moms never get prediabetes. Wait, what? Let me just... Yeah, this is all the people at risk for prediabetes and way over here, busy moms. No? Hi, I'm Jim Knox, and a lot of people have asked me, hey, what do you do away from the ballpark? Well, I am co-founder of a company called Identity Media Services. Our Emmy Award-winning production team can brand your company with videos, commercials, radio, and television, and our digital performance program specializes in lead generation, websites, and reputation management. So if your business needs a lift, give me a call, because as you know, it is tough to stay on top. Whew, that's gotta hurt. Hey Gabby, how you doing? How was the play date and sleepover? Dad, it was great. Awesome. Okay, I'm on my way. Hey guys, what are you doing? We're going swimming! We're going bucket! Yeah! I'll see you in a little bit, guys. I love you. Hi babe, how was school today? Hi Dad, it was great. Okay honey, I'll be home soon. Remember, you're never too far away from your kids to be a dad. Reach out and take a second to check in. Because sometimes the smallest moments can have the biggest impact on a child's life. Today with Candace has been brought to you by Weir's Furniture. Weir's Furniture is family owned and has been helping DFW families create their own special style of living for nearly 70 years. With a visit to Weir's, you can pick from hundreds of items for indoor and outdoor living. And you don't have to drive far. They have five locations in the Metroplex. Welcome back everyone. Joining me now is Dr. Charlotte Hodges. Most viewers will probably recognize her from New U Bariatrics, but Dr. Hodges is here today to talk about a new venture called Principle 6 Fertility. Dr. Hodges, thanks so much for being here. Oh, thank you for having me. Yes, it's great to see you. Good to see you too. So if you would start off by telling us exactly what is Principle 6 Fertility. Well, Principle 6 Fertility is a wonderful supplement that my husband and I created in an effort to help families grow. It was born out of labor of love for us. My husband and I were undergoing IVF. We had two failed attempts and at the third try, our fertility doctor wanted me to take a slew of supplements. He had me on 17, 18 different supplements. Oh my goodness. Oh my gosh. In addition to doing all the shots that he wanted. Right. And I work with a nutritionist and I told him, I said, there has to be a better way. And he said, well, why don't you make your own? So we did. So we looked at all of the ingredients, we used the best science, and behind that science we found the six best ingredients 
And that's how we develop Principal Six Fertility. That is so great. Yeah. And how long should one take it? And what is the, you know, the process? How many do they take each day? Well, generally patients just need to take five supplements a day. Okay. Um, you get the best results after about three months. All the literature that's out there says, if you're able to take these specific ingredients for 90 days, you're gonna have the best outcomes. But patients will start to see good results even after the first 15 to 30 days. Oh, how awesome. How can people find it? Well, they can go to our website, www.principal6fertility.com. Patients are able to order right online. Um, they can have a 30-day supply or they can even get set up for a 90-day supply. And if they do that, then they'll get a 90-day supply of their prenatal vitamin for free as well. Oh, wow. Great. Yes. And this has to be so rewarding for you too, to having gone through this yourself, to you know be able to spread this and share the share the love, if you will, with other, you know, women that want to have a family. Oh, absolutely. I mean, it was such a struggle for us. Um, and my heart really goes out to ladies and to their families whenever you want to grow and have a baby. So mm -hmm. whether someone's going through IVF or IUI or even if they're in their 20s and they're just thinking about starting a family, sure. the supplement can really help them. Really anyone that's you know ready to start their family or whether you're dealing with infertility or not, it would be a great supplement. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Okay. Well, thank you so much, Dr. Hodges. Great oh, to see you. Thank you. While having a child can be an expensive process, things don't get cheaper once they're born. Here with some ways to take the family out for some food and fun on a budget is Nadia Katrina with Pennywise DFW. Got kids? Tired of cooking? At Unleavened Fresh Kitchen, kids under 12 years old eat free every day after 4 p.m. With gluten-free, vegetarian, and vegan options, your kiddos are bound to devour a healthy choice. Head over to Unleavened in Dallas to snatch a kid's meal today. Searching for sushi? Craving a Cali roll? The Bluefish has happy hour sushi and drink specials Monday through Friday from 4.30 to 7 p.m. Head over to thebluefishsushi.com to find a location nearest you. If you consider yourself a wingman or a wingwoman, Go For It Sports Grill in Dallas has 50 cent wings every Thursday, as well as 75 cent peel and eat shrimp. Pair it with happy hour Monday through Friday from 3 to 7 p.m. Passionate about poker? Go For It Sports Grill also has Texas Hold'em Tuesdays, free to play every week at 7 and 10 p.m with $50 and $100 cash prizes. Head over to GoForItSportsGrill.com for more information. Looking for a blockbuster on a budget? Cinemark Movies 10th Theater in Plano, Movies 8 in Louisville, Movies 8 in North Richland Hills, and Hollywood USA 15 in Garland has $1 movie deals every Tuesday, as well as tickets for $1.40 before 1 p.m. Senior citizens can also pay $1.10 every Monday. Be sure to check out Cinemark.com for more details. Or, if you're longing for the jungle but too busy for a safari, head over to the Fort Worth Zoo for half price tickets every Wednesday and $5 parking. Toddlers under two are also free. Thanks for tuning in to another edition of Pennywise DFW. Be sure to visit our website at todaywithcandice.com to find more information about these deals and explore other ways to receive freebies, giveaways, and much, much more. See you next time. Thanks for those great tips, Nadia. Well, that's our show for today. I hope you've enjoyed it. Remember, if it deals with your home, your health and beauty, or how to spend your leisure time in DFW, then we'll be talking about it. Check us out at todaywithcandice.com and follow us on social media. We'll be here every weekday morning at 8.30, but if you can't join us, then be sure to set your DVR. See you next time. Wardrobe for today with Candace provided by Dillard's, the style of your life.